Hey, this is Matt Holden coming to you from Nashville. I'm going to show you a little um, tutorial on how to use Helix as a controller for Pro Tools because it's been not the easiest getting it set up. So what I'm going to do, we're going to go to create a new session. We're going to title it Helix. Da. Create, save, create a new track, stereo, guitar. In order to get it set up as a controller, we're going to go to Setup, Peripherals. You're going to check both these boxes. You're going to choose Helix here. Now originally I had this at 127 and it won't let you do it. Look, it'll give you an error. The outgoing MMC device ID cannot be 127 when control of Pro Tools via MMC is enabled as this would cause a feedback loop. So what I did was I changed it to 126 and then left this one at 127. Now it works. So you're going to go to HX Edit. You're going to go to your templates. You're going to go to 04C DA Remote. Double click it. That's going to give you this template, and then you can change your amp settings and whatever up here. And now your board is going to have the bottom four are going to say rewind, forward, stop, and play. So if you want to record, you're going to click the record enable button up here. And now when you click on play on your Helix, it's going to record whatever is coming through track one. So I'm going to hit play. It's playing. I'll drag this over from the edit window so you can see. Now I'll hit stop on the Helix and it'll stop it. So there you go. So that's pretty much as simple as it is to get Pro Tools up and running with the Helix. It took me a while to figure it out, but there you go, and hopefully that helps some other people out. Till next time, thanks guys. Talk to you later.